Hi, I'm Eric Blevins here at Pocket Gamer Connect 2018 in San Francisco, and I'm joined by Benny Yang from CryptoKitties. Welcome. Hi, thanks for inviting me on the show. Absolutely. And I think this is fitting. It's also Blockchain Gamer Connects as well. Yes. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah, glad to have you. Why don't you first tell us um, what led you to CryptoKitties? What have you been up to? Well, it's, uh, it's been a team effort. Um, and, you know, we're all part of a parent company called Axiom Zen. It's a venture studio based in uh, a small little city called Vancouver in Canada. <laughs> and uh, this started about five years ago. Uh, it's uh, fully self-funded. And the premise is, can we get the best people all around the world to be under one roof to build sustainable businesses? So uh, as a venture studio in the early starts, we were working with Fortune 500 companies. And the revenue that we were making from these, these, these uh, partnerships uh, we would funnel back into creating our own startups. So, uh, you know, and the best way to think about it is like we're a startup that builds startups. Uh, last summer, we got together, we were like, hey, you know, cats own the internet, uh, why don't they own the blockchain? Uh, but more deeper to that, it was kind of the dialogue in the crypto space that we saw so much opportunity that should be explored, but we saw through headlines in the news all the time, it was the price of Bitcoin, it was ICOs, and it was the hacks and scams that were happening. So we asked ourselves, can we build something that is consumer facing, that our moms and dads would get excited about? Yeah. So you're obviously ahead of the curve. What makes CryptoKitties different than some of the other blockchain-based games that are out now? Well, there's not that many mm -hmm. at this point. Uh, we, we are considered to be the world's first and the world's biggest in terms of how many players we have. We're starting to see a lot of people from the crypto side who are not necessarily have experience with gaming, building games. And that's kind of considered like us, like technologists who are interested in it. Previous to this, we never really, we haven't had any huge success with big games. And then you see gaming companies who are then, oh, how can we incorporate blockchain in? And it, it's, it's interesting to see how the paintings are, are both similar but also different. Right. Yeah. And, and what role do cryptocurrencies play in CryptoKitties? You know, can you use any cryptocurrency? Do you have to have it or can you play without it? Yeah. So you have to have uh, cryptocurrency and to you know, adopt or sell or to breed these kitties, uh, you need to use Ether. Uh, Ether is part of Ethereum, which is the second biggest cryptocurrency right now. As of now, what platforms is CryptoKitties available on? So CryptoKitties is a desktop game. Uh, it's an HTML5, so you just go to CryptoKitties.co and you can play the game. Uh, that being said, we are working on Android and an iOS version. Uh, that way you can play the CryptoKitties on the go. And as you go from one platform to the next, what is your overall monetization strategy? Is it all in-app or are you going to be doing ad-based monetization? Uh, the gross market volume of CryptoKitties in the marketplace is about $40 million USD. Uh, we've sold about six or seven cats for over $100,000 USD. So a lot of capital has gone into, into CryptoKitties and we have a ton of players. Um, the, the way that the business model works is that we take 3.75% of all transactions that happen in the marketplace. Very cool. And then these crypto kitties can be bought, sold, etc. Through, through the platform, correct? So they could be bought, sold, and you could breed in the platform. Uh -huh. So if you have some kitties and you're like, hey, this one's pretty cool, uh, I want to list it up for breeding, uh, someone will pay you actually you can make an earning from it. So this is a very interesting point is that we have people who are full-time cat breeders who quit their job and they're breeding cats now. I think I'm gonna have to go start my first uh, crypto kitty farm perhaps, yeah. yeah. Benny, I wanna thank you for yeah. coming in. This is really interesting. Thanks for the insights. Yeah, thank you so much. Absolutely. Cheers. Cheers.